Hello everyone, welcome back and you are watching my youtube channel technical world. Today in this video I am going to show you how to fix whatsapp push notification not working on iphone and ipad after or before ios update. So without wasting any time let's get started. And before start please don't forget to subscribe. The first thing that we have to do enable background app refresh. For that first launch settings now find and tap on whatsapp and under whatsapp enable background app refresh you can also check this setting go to settings and general and tap background app refresh and make sure that whatsapp is enabled now we go for solution number two enable push notification for that first launch settings then tap notification now check the whatsapp and tap on whatsapp and make sure that allow notification is enabled and also make sure that these three checks are enabled now we go for solution number three turn off do not disturb first launch settings then tap do not disturb and make sure that do not disturb is disabled Now we go for solution number 4, disable low power mode, first launch settings, then tap periphery and make sure that low power mode is disabled. Now we go for solution number 5, update whatsapp. For that first connect to Wi-Fi or cellular data then tap and hold the app store and menu will appear and we have to tap on updates. Now. We have to check the list is there is any update available for whatsapp if is there is then tap on update to update whatsapp now we go for solution number six check the latest version of ios to check that first launch settings then tap general and tap software update and update your iphone if latest update is available now we go for solution number seven reset network settings first launch settings then tap general and tap reset and tap reset network settings put iphone passcode and tap again reset network settings in pop-up window to confirm your action now we go for solution number eight delete and reinstall whatsapp for that tap and hold whatsapp and a menu will appear and we have to tap on remove app after that go back to app store and re-download whatsapp now we go for final solution reset all setting this process will delete all your customized setting to default setting but no data or media will be deleted to reset all setting on iphone first launch settings then tap general now tap reset and tap reset all settings iphone passcode required and tap again reset all settings in pop-up window to confirm your action that's it Hopefully friends you found this video helpful so please don't forget to subscribe, like and share with your friends and family. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.